I got the cutest little dog the other day. He's a poodle, and I named him Brad. It's an interesting name for a dog. Yeah, I know. When I was in grade school, I had a crush on this guy named Brad, and the name just kind of came into my head. Brad. So, uh, did you get a new part-time job? Yeah, yeah. I kind of had to quit my last one. I mean, at that uh, Italian restaurant, why'd you quit? It's a long story. I don't even know where to start. Well, um, like Mary Poppins said, start at the very beginning, very good place to start. It wasn't Mary Poppins, it was the sound of music. No way, dude, that was totally Mary Poppins. No, it was totally the sound of music. Yeah, yeah, right, 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 but wasn't Mary Poppins in the sound of music? No, uh, it's two different movies. Are you sure? Yes. Really? Hey, um, sorry to interrupt, but he is right. Uh, Julie Andrews played Maria in The Sound of Music. <laughs> Maria, Mary, what's the difference? I mean, seriously. Yeah, Maria Poppins, I'm an idiot. So, where did you get your poodle? Uh, a couple of weeks ago, I decided I needed a new man in my life, but I'm sick of men, so I decided to get a puppy instead. And I went to the shelter, and I so, saw him. Maria, let's hear it. Start at the very beginning, because this line isn't going anywhere. What? Your story, why did you quit your job? Oh, yeah, right. So, uh, you ever hear the saying, don't shit where you sleep? <laughs> what is this, trivia night? No, just don't shit where you sleep. What are you talking about? Never mind. Just tell the damn story already. Fine. So, about a month ago at work, this girl starts working with me, and she is hot. Oh, uh, okay, 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 it's starting to make sense. So, um, a hot girl starts working and, uh, oh, Brad's out the door, I quit. What is wrong with you? Do you want to hear this story or not? I don't uh, want to tell it to you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, to, I'm so sorry. I, I had no more interruptions. Fine, so after, like, this girl starts working with me and everything, she's, like, flirting with me and I'm flirting back with her, you know. So what's her, what's her name? What does it matter? You don't know her. Oh, come on, I, I hate hearing stories without a name. Just give her a name. Fine, I'll call her Mary Poppins. How does that work for you? Uh, I, I guess that, that'll work good enough for um, storytelling purposes. Continue on. Okay, so after about a week of working and flirting and everything with Mary Poppins, yeah. I asked her if she wants to get a drink with me. And? And she said yes. So we went out to a club, we danced, we did shot after shot. Which uh, club did you take her to? What does it matter? Just give it a name. I don't care. Make something up. Fine. We went to, I don't know, the Electric Cactus. Really? I'm surprised that you went there. It doesn't seem like a uh, right kind of place. Why is that? You've been there? Yeah. Like, um, last Saturday, you know, Morty was bartending and, um... There's not my kind of place, but it's your kind of place. Where's well, it at? It, it's like, I don't know, up in 24th and... Oh, 24th, 24th then you're an idiot. I made it up. Well, it's kind of hard to make something up when uh, like, I go there Whatever. and stuff. Shut up. You want to hear this story? So we go to the Barracuda, right? Because she's okay. like, I don't know, hip or classy or something, you know? Mary Poppins? Yeah, Mary Poppins. So after we're dancing and drinking and everything, we start making out. Did um, she kiss you or did you kiss her? I don't know, man. We were drunk. Okay, okay, so what happened after the making out? You'd already know if you didn't stop me to ask me, like, what color her t-shirt was. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What color is her t-shirt? So we take a cab back to her place, right? Yeah. And we're like, we're actually making out in the cab the whole time. The driver's, like, stopped in front of her house for, like, five minutes before we even noticed. <laughs> was he pissed? I don't know, but he better not have been. I gave him a $5 tip, and he got a little show. <laughs> so we get up to her house, and all she has is wine. All she... Oh, okay, okay, so you're, you're like, on her couch at, like, a hot girl's house, and, and all you're thinking about is, oh, what you got to drink? Tell me why, and then I want to fear. Brad, 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 it's alcohol. It'll get you drunk. I spilled wine on my carpet the other day. I'm just not a fan of it, but, you know, I have a glass with her anyways. Wait, well, what kind was it? Cause it, it, it was Merlot. So, after a few glasses of the wine and everything, we start making out, she rips my shirt off. <laughs> I... Yeah, so then, you know, I'm like, all right, so I take off her shirt and take off her bra, you know, everything, and toss her on the bed really smoothly. <laughs> Pretty proud of myself, I must say. I have a picture of my dog on my phone, you want to see it? Yeah, for sure. So then, Trevor, I take my pants off, and you know what she says to me? <laughs> that is the smallest, cutest thing I have ever seen. Oh, my God. What did she say? Sorry, man, hold on a second. She said, sorry, man, hold on a second? No, that's what I said. You told her, sorry, man, hold on a second? No, I like, told you that. I wasn't even there. Even where? 
I'm sorry. I lost my train of thought. I was just telling you to hold on a second. Okay, okay, okay. So you toss Mary Poppins on the bed, and then you take her pants off. Okay, right. So then she says she didn't know if we should, like, sleep together or not. So what did you do? I told her that was fine and started looking for my pants. But then she grabs me, gets on top of me, and starts kissing on me. <laughs> Playing the, uh, the modest guy with manners. Uh, strategy has worked for uh, friend Trevor here on a couple of occasions. I bet it has, but I wasn't playing anything. I'm just a nice guy, and no does mean no. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, apparently it didn't that time. Wait, you're a nice guy? This line hasn't even moved yet. It's the holdup. Who knows? Hey, do you want to go to the dog park with me tomorrow? Sure, what time? Um, like 11. Sounds good. Did you pick up your dog's poop? Yeah. It's not that big of a deal, it's just poop. <laughs> Okay, so check this out. After she's kissing on me, she ends up going down on me. Nice! That is so gross. It's not that big of a deal. And besides, you have to do it. Really? Yeah. At least in Portland you do. So, uh, did you two, um, fuck uh, monkeys? Yeah, it was good. So, what's the problem? Why'd you quit your job? Uh, I'll tell you after the movie.